and Shisha. Welcome to my channel. Today I am going to show you a very simple curry vegetable stew Kerala style that is vegetable stew recipe. Here I have 1 carrot peeled and chopped, 3 to 4 beans, chopped 1 to 2 tablespoon of green peas, half of a medium size onion sliced, 1 in ginger julienne, 3 to 4 tablespoon of green chili sliced, 3 boiled potatoes diced, 2 cloves, 1 to 2 cardamoms, 1 inch cinnamon, 8 to 10 numbers of black pepper and optional black pepper powder, a few curry leaves, 1 to 2 tablespoon of coconut oil, 1 cup of thick coconut milk and 1 cup of semi thick coconut milk and salt to taste. Boil carrots, beans and green peas until they become tender and if there is any water, drain them and keep them aside. Heat coconut oil in a pan, add in the spices, cloves, cardamom and cinnamon and the black pepper and saute for a few seconds on low flame. Then add in the ginger slices and saute for a few minutes. Then add in the green chilies and the onion slices and saute until the onion slices, they become transparent. Throw in some curry leaves and saute well. To it add the diced potatoes and saute well. Now add in the boiled vegetables, carrots, beans and green peas into it and mix well. Pour in the semi-thick coconut milk that is randam pal in Malayalam into it and stir well and bring it to boil. And then reduce the flame and let it simmer for a minute. Then put the thick coconut milk, the onna pal in Malayalam into it and stir well and bring it to boil. But as soon as it reaches the uh, boiling point, like it starts bubbling on the edges of the pan of the curry, put off the flame immediately or the coconut milk will curdle. And then add salt to taste and if you prefer this curry to be little more spicy, then sprinkle some black pepper powder onto it and stir well. And that's it. My mixed vegetable stew or Kerala style vegetable stew is ready to serve. Serve it hot with appam or idiapams, the popular ones, or with dosha, idli, chapati, rice, as you wish. Enjoy!